Here you can see Apple's MagSafe array, and here you can see the Peak Design Magnet Array. Let's talk magnets. The biggest issue we have with magnets and magnetic arrays is that our intuition does not work. You go to any sort of engineering course in college, you learn very well how something like carbon fiber or aluminum or steel, they bend and they break. But the thing about magnets is your intuition is almost always wrong and you just have to test it in real life. And so that's where we've been building these 3D printed prototypes as well as cases. And then we've used our own testing jigs to understand how these magnets are actually acting. So the first machine is what we call our shear force testing. This shearing force is something we find very important because when you mount it to the car mount, we don't want it falling off when you go over a speed bump or go over a little pothole. The second machine is what we call our Z force. And that's what I think most of our users are going to interact with. When you put SlimLink onto the case and you're going to pull it off, this force it takes to pull off is also another variable we want to control very tightly. And then we've got one more machine at the back and that is to measure torque. When you take something like the um, Apple case and you put the Apple wallet on, the wallet aligns very well to the case. And what we want to do is we want to make sure we have that as well for our products so that they align very well to the phone. When it comes to deciding what is the best magnet combination, for us, the very first thing is functionality and the very last thing is some of this like cost kind of issues because we know our customers are willing to pay for a good product. And so all of this testing allows us to walk away and say, you know what, we know it feels good and we have the numbers to prove that it is as good as we think it is. That's kind of what this table and this whole room is dedicated to, is figuring out the best kind of magnets to put inside of our case. It's complicated. Ha, ha, ha.